With Josh and Arnaz, I had cute and adorable. Forget about those high school boys. Here. Hey, tonight we're gonna be hanging at the hot tub if you wanna stop by. Should be pretty cool. Well, if it's gonna be cool, shouldn't we call it the cool tub? <laughs> Hurry up and get out of here before my dad and mommy weirdest get back. <laughs> hey, girl. Right. We'll be back. We have friends waiting for us by the pool. It's embarrassing. Ooh, did Joshua Arnaz call? Hey, what's happening to us? You're getting all weepy over androgynous rock stars, and I went out and bought these. They're night vision binoculars, so I can see Josh and Arnaz at night from afar. Brianna. Oh, say it with me, girl. It's you and me. I'm finally free. Demanding you cease publication of your calendar at once. Arnez, I'm not in the mood for this. Looking at all this. Oh, please, I don't care if any other girl looks at uh, all that. <laughs> Will you have your shirt off underneath your parka? <laughs> Work it. <laughs> I was being an entrepreneur. That's not fair. Don't you stomp your feet at me, little lady. <laughs> no, there's a trail of ants. What? Oh, my. Stifler of creativity. Oh dear, I do agree. I'm feeling rather stifled as we speak. I'll give you fifty dollars right now if you could tell me what stifle means. I'd love to host the salon so our artistic minds may meet. Manolo's? Salani, huh? <laughs> Just serve the drinks and serve the food, okay? Dramatic <laughs> taste. So tell us, what's your favorite? Waiting to exhale or the color? Purple. Well, I think I would have to say way the color purple. <laughs> I believe my new man is a gangster. <laughs> hey, my father was having a senior moment and he just turned 35. Daddy kitchen now. Uh, you are pimping me to get a story. I would never do such a thing. Now put on some lip gloss and go talk to the boy. Fi, don't get this interview. <laughs> so, Brenna Barnes, why not you hot for me? You're a little too high profile for me. I have to be the star in all my relationships. <laughs> my entrance, fool. <laughs> Once they see me and all my... <laughs> Fineness. They have no choice but to fight over me again, and all this friendship nonsense will be over with. Yes, yes, I know, I know. You're being blinded by all this fineness. <laughs> Hot. No! Don't fight over me like I'm some rare, precious trophy. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, girl. Did I already tell you this story? Dumping you, Josh dumping you? Uh uh, uh uh. I dumped them. Where did you get a bucket of fresh tap maple syrup? Original design by the end of this week. Look at Arnez, talking to that girl. That's probably the hoochie he lost his virginity to. Maybe we should think about U of A, University of Arnez. <laughs> Always accepting applications. Yeah, that's the problem. I hear it's very easy to get into. But we had an agreement, partner. I don't set you up with my friend's moms, and I don't have to be buddy-buddy with your girlfriend's kids. Especially dumb kids. <laughs> oh, let's see. She's beautiful with a banging body and is a master manipulator. Just like you. It's equals two, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, go with that. <laughs> Such a rough neck. But I can... <laughs> Flashcards and they're in the shape of hearts because I cut them and I cut them some okay, more. Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. You're not going to break my hearts, are you? <laughs> Thanks, John. <laughs> Listen, E-boy, besides being too young, you're a little too shady for me. What are you talking about? I got pink eye. <laughs> Eric, or should I call you Trout for taking the bait? No, we got to think the story's fake. Now the scoop is all yours, Daddy. Good, Mommy, thank you. <laughs> you're getting married here? Daddy? Sister? Yeah, I'm thrilled. Can't you see the joy plastered all over my face? Oh, no, wait. First, you must scrape away the pain. You're gonna get everything I didn't have. <laughs> Hello? Dang, I missed it again. 
my skirt. I have an easier time keeping track of my hat. <laughs> Some wheels and a trumpet and create a bandwagon. Then we go town to town playing music and selling hats? Maybe it's a metaphor. All right, now go sell some hats so we can get you into a better school. Go on. You answered it so quickly and so stylishly. Yes, yes, no fumbling through my purse for this girl. My phone's my hat, and it's all that. <laughs> Call them facts. 500 bucks. Wait, hold on. Let's tell them. Like their pizza. Yeah. It's really good pizza. <laughs> now, back to our chemistry. Oh, here he comes. Watch me work. <laughs> Nice shirt, you look great. I think I should nominate you for one of Baltimore's 50 Most Beautiful. 1201 Regret. <laughs> Good day. You must be the apple of his eye. Yeah, he's all right. See, in home ec, I mean, who needs boiling the bag rice when you got all this ready-made cuteness? <laughs> See, oh, girl, you got a secret admirer. Oh, I wonder who it could be. <laughs> And I specifically asked for roses. How are some tired carnations gonna convince him that I too can have someone hot for me? No tip for you. Ah, uh, looks like your mystery guy struck again. From your other secret admirer. What? Who? Daddy, it's just a chair. White guilt is a cash cow. <laughs> well, I think we made just enough to replace my daddy's new chair. Come on, let's go to the furniture store before they close.